know DOC. I didn't know any of that stuff till I started watch till I watched Straight Outta Compton. I'm like, oh, okay. And of course, he's mentioned DOC before. Listen, yeah. man. But that's the only time I knew about the story I of had, DOC. That's I, it. I had to check a couple of them on here about DOC, man. Rainwater, uh, DOC, and I got to get. I quote: the DOC came to him before he left to go to California. To I sign. can't tell you one DOC song. Formula, nigga, you young. You don't know formula. High energy, full with the wisdom, sense of a rich man, knowledge and the rhythm. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Today we got a guest, man. I've been really, to be honest with you, this the one that mean a lot to me, man. This guy right here, I ain't gonna lie. When I met him, man, I was so... He was so humble, bro. That messed me up because you meet so many people and you don't know how they're gonna be when you meet them. This guy right here, man, is a, a legend, an icon to me, man. Uh, I first learned how to dance off funky enough. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna be honest with you. That's where I did my dance routine. With the deal to the C. I need a break so I can check around. Uh, me and my cousin Money Mike, you remember? I had you going over these steps over and over again to fuck you enough, nigga. Because that's where I was at with my man. My guy, DOC, is in the building. Hey, hey, man, man thank you so much, man, for coming through. I Boss see, Talk 101. The funny thing is that, you know, being from Jamaica, and I've only been here now, what, 20 years? Yeah, 20 years. So it's a case where I didn't know DOC. I didn't know any of that stuff till I started watch, till I watched Straight Outta Compton. I'm like, oh, okay. And of course, he's mentioned DOC before. Listen, yeah. man. But that's the only time I knew about the story I of had, DOC. That's I, it. I yeah. had to check a couple of them on here about DOC, man. Rainwater, uh, DOC. And I got to get, I quote, the DOC came to him before he left to go to California. To I sign. can't tell you one DOC song. Formula, nigga, you young. You don't know formula? High energy, full with the wisdom, sense of a rich man, knowledge and the rhythm. This is what I'm using to come up with a style. That's what I'm saying. Dallas don't get behind their rappers. They should, they should, they still should be playing it. They don't say they don't play it on the radio. That was a big. If song. you go to Houston, they go play. They playing Beyonce old stuff. They Beyonce, playing all the yeah, old, Kiki folks. old stuff. The South old side. music. They playing. It. I can't tell you one one DLC song. But they, why they don't play it though, right? I don't know. We need. That's why I'm trying to figure out. We need to go, everybody need to collective understand. They, you better go listen to it. If you ain't, you don't know it. You need to get to know it. I was like, <laughs> man, you can't come in here and say nothing. Don't you got to say Doc in here because we got some legends in the city. Even Ald, mm -hmm. I got to call these people out that I done check, but. The reality of it is Dallas don't have hip hop infrastructure. It, it's it, I don't know if I agree with that. Dallas got hip hop infrastructure. You got some guys here that done made numbers that done did. You got platinum artists. You got time. some platinum artists here in this city. You mm -hmm. got DeRoe. You got different people that done did. You got DOC here. Mm -hmm. You can't say that we don't have a foundation. If I was to build, to, oh, you know what I'm saying. You. Oh, you got you, hey, listen, playing, listen, you got a hell of a foundation. Games. You know what I'm saying. You got some patriarchs here, man. You got some people that got them. Do you plaques, not know that you know I'm well I'm loved in Dallas? You know Why you trying to do that? I didn't you, say that. You try, am I right? I feel, I feel I'm like you trying to create. I'm right. You looking? You trying to go over there? When you look at it, you just you trying to make an adversarial thing. No, like when you look at it and you look at some of the artists that we've interviewed here that have those accomplishments. Not many. You're right about that. Because Dallas me, is not as big as, as Houston either, to be honest but, with but, you. <laughs> but I want to know, so where did the name DOC come from? Because, you know, I see your initials of your name and that's like, I'm like, no, that's not it. So where did DOC come from? What is that? Well, I was uh, I was Doc T as a young guy. Okay. Uh, that That's my first original rap name rap is name. Doc T. Okay. Yeah. So you just dropped the T off. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. And because they was NWA, I just put the periods in mind, too. Right. Oh, okay. That's dope. So how did you end up? Okay, so growing up, you were born and raised here in Dallas. Mm -hmm. And you end up all the way over there. How did that happen? And when did you want to start rapping? How old were you? What was your um, environment like? All of that juice. I mean. What part of Dallas were you from? 
West Dallas. West Dallas. Dallas. Shout out to uh, Charles Rambo, my cousin, them over yeah, there, all man. them Rambos. Yeah, I'm not man. playing no games, y'all already know. <laughs> Shout yeah, out man. to everybody that rock with E over in West Dallas. Yeah, no, man. I go crazy. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> Who did we interview in LA that surprised you and said that, that, was that he that was. That boy, that boy, uh, 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 I call him Hutch. Above the law. But what was it? Yeah. What yeah. was it? Hey, 187 yeah. something I found Hutch, out. Hutch, but it's yeah. Hutch, though. You know what I'm saying? Ruthless Records, NWA. EGE, Above the Law, so on and so on, Cocaine, um, the DLC, you know, I came from when they first developed Ruthless Records, you yeah, know, when they, you know, and all that. Yeah, y'all slid on us, because you being from West <laughs> Dallas, y'all, y'all come, you come down there, you took DOC from us, which he needed to go. I remember, man, I hate to go to work, Dr. Feel Rock fresh and all crew, of them. Feel the fresh yeah, crew, feel the fresh crew. That's kind of mm-hmm. how you guys yeah. end up linking with him, right? That's right, yeah, uh, it was at a, uh, at a mall, they performed yeah. the Feel the Fresh Fresh, Fresh crew, crew performed at a uh, mall and we like they like Doc. So. Yeah, yeah. Y'all picked Doc and yeah. took him. <laughs> yeah, but the boy still held on to the Dallas Cowboy jersey. Oh yeah, you know we gonna do that anyway, <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah, we were yeah. shocked when was he shocked. mentioned that he was from West Dallas. We didn't even know. You yeah. know, I went crazy about the DOC on that one. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm, man. I'm a fan, bro. Yeah, man. Like, like I'm I'm older. I remember when hip hop came on the scene. I get to play the fan role. He is the artist. You know? <laughs> Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.